Hey guys, so here's a video on honestly what is the best tower in the game. It completely dominates literally everything, and for around $80,000, you can solo so far into the game. And that tower is none other than the Apache Prime. Or at least, that's what I would say. Unfortunately, I was told that this is a glitch, and that the Apache Prime isn't actually this good. And when I used it one day on stream, on chimps mode, it wasn't doing nearly as much as I wanted it to. So let's take a look at why the Apache Prime is so darn overpowered. As we go into free play on hard mode, you'll see exactly why. It fires so fast, and if you've watched ISAB's deflation video, you'll understand. Apparently this is a glitch that happens when you invest into some points in the military tree for monkey knowledge but unfortunately I think that effect goes away if you also invest into other points and that's probably why I don't experience the glitch anymore it's either that or I just don't experience it anymore because my game was updated I'm not really exactly sure but one thing's for certain is that when I have this tower I have used it you see the Apache on its own without the Apache Prime upgrade could basically take on round 80. That allowed you to save up for the Apache Prime and then take out round 100. It was simple as that. This tower was so broken, and actually this isn't even just hard mode, this is alternate balloons mode. And so when we get to round 99 and round 100, you're gonna see how crazy the Apache really is. But honestly, for $70,000, you can just see this tower. Look at how far the balloons are getting against this. It is round 89, and literally my other towers have done nothing. You see, my, my submarine hasn't even done anything. We're just watching this Apache just absolutely eat these balloons' asses, and it's it was really great. And I'm really glad I got footage of just how good this tower was before it unfortunately was unnerfed. And here you can see DDTs, yeah, sometimes give it trouble. They move fast, but honestly, if you have bigger jets, it's not that much of a problem. And look at those fortified DDTs. Absolutely destroyed. It's no wonder this tower was nerfed, though. Honestly, I really wish the tower was this good in general, but worth like $300,000. Because honestly, this would be a really fun tower to use, and I think it'd be fun. It absolutely just destroys everything, and definitely well worth the money that you spend on it. Unfortunately, it can't even take on, like, round 90 anymore with the nerf. So, unfortunately, you're never going to see it do crazy stuff like this. But look at the, yeah, here's a fortified ZOMG literally just gone. Gone. Get got. Get got. Get 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 got 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 got. Anyway, see these group of ZOMGs absolutely just getting destroyed. And here, here we go. Round 99. I gotta play this at normal speed. Round 99 on alternate balloons round. You don't know. You're gonna see something pretty cool. I don't know if pe I haven't seen too many people play this far into alternate balloons rounds, but there's a bad on round 99. So we're gonna see just how good. I, I sell my Sun God. I sell my Bloon Jitsu. I sell the sub. And look at that. Look at that. Look at how quickly. Look at how quickly it takes care of that bad. And here we go. A fortified bad on round 100. Never thought you would see that, right? Look at this. Look at how quickly. Look at how fast it is taking out that lair. Almost on its own. I mean, the mob mauler really isn't doing anything. DDTs get eaten up. And now there's only two fortified ZOMGs, which we've proved earlier, that it just eats up. So wow, what a crazy tower. How far do you think this will go? How far do you think this tower can solo into the late game? Well, I was rigged to find out. We'll need to see those balloons. Plasma balloons give it trouble because it shoots lasers, but you know what? It also shoots rockets, so we can take care of plasma balloons. Those are no big deal. There's not anything to worry about. Let's see how far this one tower can really go. Um, what is this? What is that a sur what what why why isn't it getting popped? What is going on? I I just lost. 
round 101 to some crazy unkillable balloon that I don't really know what happened. But you know what? We take it further. So I went into four circles on normal mode, and we're taking on round 130. Two times speed. How far do you think this thing can solo now? We have Gwendolyn for the buffs, and the merchant boat to give us some more money for absolutely no reason. How far? How far can we take this heli pilot? Well, I'm going to tell you, it's not too much farther than this, unfortunately. I wasn't really watching my screen um, when I had this going. I just hit and record, walked off, see how far I could go. And, yeah. Doesn't make it too much farther than this, but, like, look at just... For an $80,000 tower to get this far already is absolutely insane. Oh, and this is, this is impoppable. So balloons move even faster, and honestly, it's the speed that probably kills us. This thing has enough, it does, deals enough damage. I mean, look at, just look at how crazy, look at the lasers, look how many lasers it shoots out. But yeah, we lose it to a crazy fast balloon, and that's it. So I really hope you enjoyed this unnerfed Apache Prime video, and I will see you all later. Peace.